Nicole is back at the vet. He was here last week. Um, his arthritis is really bothering him and he can't take any Medicam, so we're trying this new shot. Yeah. Uh, so I'll tell you all about the shot after he's done. He's just here at our Cranberry Hill vet again. He's gonna try something new for arthritis, right buddy? So it's really windy out here. I don't know if you guys can hear me and my little flyer is blowing away. Um, so yesterday Cole went to the vet to get his first shot of what's called Labrella. So I'll turn over alternative arthritis pain for a full month. So he has to go in each month and get one of these shots. This is his first shot. They said the best is after the third shot. So we'll see how it goes. Um, we had been giving Cole Medicam and we tried gabapentin and we used some holistic things, but he was still in a lot of pain and the gabapentin and the medicam made him sleep all the time and be kind of groggy. Um, a couple of times I even had to poke him to see if he was still alive, which was really scary. We didn't want to have that. So our vet uh, did a full blood work, looked him over because we thought maybe he had kidney or liver issues or something was wrong, but he was fine. It was his pain in his back. So you can see he's good up here, but as soon as they moved down his back, oh, he's looking standing. He was caving his back in here. You can see a little bit. As soon as you go, see his back legs are going down, uh, that he was in a lot of pain. And I think that's why he was sleeping all the time and even not coming up to bed at night, wanting to just sleep on the couch, which is not like our boy. So we decided, um, the vet phoned earlier this week and she's like, let's make an appointment right away. Let's get him on this stuff. So we had his first shot of labrella yesterday. Uh, they just put it in his rough right here, took his weight, got this stuff right, right, put it in here and we were done. It was like five minutes in the vet office. That was about it. And now we have to wait and see what happens in a month. Uh, right after, it maybe gave him a teeny bit more energy. It, we did, we were like, oh look, he's awake and he's coming around us a bit and maybe he is feeling better. Um, and then um, this morning he woke up with us. And he wasn't just lying comatose on our bed, all stretched out. He was sitting up, watching where we were, seeing what was going on. He came in the bathroom and watched my husband shower, which he hasn't done in forever and wanted to lick the wet off the floor. Uh, so we are ready on day two, seeing a whole bunch of signs that it's working. He wouldn't even sit before. This is him sitting. I couldn't get him to sit. He would only lie down. He didn't want to sit. His back was hurting so bad. So he's already starting to feel the, feel the benefits of the shot, they claim that there's no side effects and no lasting effects. I, I mean, who knows what that says. Um, but anyways, this is all the different things they say about it. I know Medicam can be hard on the liver and the kidneys, but this is minus price. So we didn't even have to see the vet, we just saw a vet technician. I wanna look a little bit more up about this and I'll put a little blurb either me talking about it or um, some writing about it here. But anyways, we're going to keep you posted on Cole's journey with Labrella. I thought I would give, do this first video just after his first shot, and then we'll see maybe the second and third little update. We're hoping this can keep him going. Sorry, he's only staying here for cookies. This will keep him going for a little while longer because um, really his health is fine. His hernia is the only thing that we worry about. It really hasn't changed much. I think it gets bigger and a bit smaller at times, but right now it's looking really good. He had to get his anal glands expressed and then I think it felt better, but that's fine. His, from his neuter, he's all healed. He has a huge, great appetite. He's hungry all the time, constantly begging for treats. So he's doing really well. His teeth don't look too bad either. I keep brushing them. So hopefully Labrella will keep us going for a while longer and keep Cole out of pain. I know a lot of people do physiotherapy or chiropractor, but uh, we haven't done that yet. We may add that to this if he needs more, but right now we're gonna give this a try first. So Cole got his labrella shot on Wednesday. It is now Saturday and he is doing so well. He has, my husband says it's his old dog is back and he's so happy and he seems to be, he's came out this morning and he wagged his tail at the birds and he just pittered around his yard and he just seems to be so much, so much, so, seems to be feeling so much better. <laughs> Um, and Ember has her best buddy to play with, right, Ember? We try not to make him do anything too strenuous. However, I think if he's feeling better, maybe he'll build some muscle back and then he'll be stronger. That's what I'm hoping. Um, I was going to say the other nice thing about the Labrella is that you don't have to get, give it every day. You don't have to remember it. You don't have to, um, you know, measure it out or anything like that. He goes once a month to the vet. Uh, the cost is about the same. Um, it could be slightly a little bit more expensive, but it's, it's like dollars more expensive a month. 
um, than your Medicam that you're giving in the syringe. You still have to get it. This, you don't have to remember to pick up any any um, liquid. You have to just go, or medication, you just have to go once a month, have an appointment. So we booked our next appointment when we um, left from his first appointment. And so we're really looking forward to seeing what happens in the next month or two. I'll keep updating you guys. I'll do another one at his two-month shot. And then it's three months shot and we'll see. I just wonder how long it's going to last. That's what I'll update you at the next one is when he starts to feel sore again. I'm hoping this will last the month. I have a feeling it may not because uh, they kept saying that the third shot was this kind of sweet spot. And I think that that's what they meant. Maybe that it lasted all month and that they just continued to feel as good the whole time. So I'm thinking maybe it will. You can see he's trying to hear <laughs> Mr. Deaf Man over there. But um, yeah, this is, as my husband said, it was way worth the money and it's, you know, night and day, our dog is back. I really thought there was something terribly wrong with him and he was dying, but I think it was just pain. He had bad arthritic pain in his back and it was really uh, hurting him. So he's feeling so much better now. So stay tuned. We'll talk to you guys again soon. Thanks so much for watching. Please subscribe.